Scientists understood where stars come from, but not how planets grow from the disk of gas and dust. The answer was discovered by accident aboard the International Space Station. Astronaut Don Pettit was experimenting with grains of sugar and salt in the weightlessness of space. Stanley Love was watching for mission control when Pettit stumbled onto the process of how planets form from cosmic dust. Well, one of Don's Saturday morning science projects was to take the bags that we store drinks in, and he put other stuff in it, like salt and sugar, and there was one bag that he just left the coffee powder in. Then he inflated the bags, and with these particles in them, noticed that the particles would just clump up immediately. They'd make a little dust bunny. We'll be spending some time watching that. I'd say, Don, this is incredible. You've just solved a 40-year-old problem in planetary science. Astronaut Pettit had discovered something big. In the zero gravity of space, particles of dust don't float apart. They clump together. This is how mighty planets are made from cosmic dust. The dust particles would collide and stick and grow into ever larger dust particles and eventually rocks and eventually boulders. The bigger the boulder, the more gravity it has. It begins to eat up everything around it and grows bigger. It becomes larger, heavier, and consumes bigger and bigger rocks. Eventually, some of these rocks grow into planets. This is what happened in our solar system 4.6 billion years ago. There were about a hundred young planets all orbiting the new sun. 